Hey there everyone, Nathan from Minnesota Mobile Guy here. Here with me today I have a Samsung Galaxy S6 that just happens to be the Sprint model. If I kick this on here and take a peek, we'll be able to see that it does have all of the Sprint apps installed there. And then if I go ahead and jump into the phone settings, we will be able to see that it is an S6 with the model number G920P, so that is the Sprint version. This is one that I currently have active here on my own Sprint line, but if you're someone who's looking to use the phone on a different carrier, that is actually possible. Now, this is only limited to carriers that are outside of the US. There's unfortunately not a method to be able to do it for US carriers, but if you're someone who travels frequently to other countries, or if you're someone in another country who purchased the phone online and would like to unlock it for use in your country that is possible. So I've got my SIM tool here that came in the box with my S6 and I'm going to go ahead and take out the Sprint SIM that is inside. And then here with me I have, it might be a little hard to see this, but it is a SIM card from a provider in the, in the uh, United Kingdom. They're called O2. So again, because this only works for international carriers, I'm going to go ahead and pop this one in there and we'll see what happens. All right, there we go. So gives us a message that we have to restart the phone now that a new SIM has been inserted. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Hold a second while it shuts off here. <clears throat> And it's coming back on here, so we'll give it just a half a minute more. All right, so Sprint phones are very unique in the method that they're unlocked and that they do not use unlock codes like GSM phones do. So with a Sprint phone, when you put in a SIM card from a different company, like I just did to the S6, and then we go ahead and turn it on here, we do not get any sort of a unlock code prompt there, as you can see from the phone. If we go ahead and pop into the notifications, we do have one that says invalid SIM card. So instead of asking us for a code to unlock the phone, it just sits there and tells us that the SIM is invalid and won't do anything else with the SIM because again, the phone has been locked. But my business offers a service whereby I can get the phone unlocked for you. So this is one that I've pre-configured to do that. All I have to do is one more reboot to the phone and then we'll see that it actually does now register with that SIM card that I have inside there. All right, one more reboot, and we'll see what happens when it comes back on. Now, I should also mention that this can also be done for the Sprint Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge, since that one and the regular S6 are virtually the same phone on the inside, the only difference being that that Edge has the screen wrapped around the sides instead. I'm going to give it a second to load things here. Okay, so now that everything's back on, if we take a peek up at the notifications in the bar there, we do not see that invalid SIM notification anymore. So that has is now gone. We have some generic ones there about voicemail and some other things, but that invalid SIM notification is now gone. So according to the phone, that international SIM is now considered a valid SIM card. Something else that we can see on the phone itself is that if we open up the apps, the phone is now loading what they call a SIM toolkit. And that's a little app that's pre-installed on the phone. It allows you to see and interact with the SIM card a little bit. Um, and so we can see that it is now loading that app and it gets the name of the carrier, which is again O2. And that would not have been present previously when we had the SIM in there. 
So again, this unlock method only applies to international carriers for use outside the US, but if you have a spread Samsung Galaxy S6 or S6 Edge and would like to get it unlocked for use in other countries, go ahead and contact me. All the details will be in the video description. Y para todos los hispanos hablantes, también hablo español, así que no duden contactarse conmigo. Thanks for watching, guys, and have a great day.